What's up guys, ComputerMD of Gilbert here, and in today's video I'm going to show you how to add slash upload documents here into your Wix website. Uh, this is very useful especially because you can make buttons here on Wix, open documents, and you also have other external apps that I've made videos on, like selling downloads, and some of those downloads may be documents like ebooks or anything like that. Before we hop into that guys, wixmywebsite.com, link in the description below. If you guys have not yet signed up for my new upcoming course, go get on that email list to get notified when it goes live. I'm here to help you guys grow your Wix knowledge and show you how to build a website from scratch to finish in really a week or less following the course accordingly. Uh, guys, it's really making me happy seeing all of you sign up and take the initiative and taking the next step. And if you haven't yet, I encourage you to do so. But for right now, let's show you how to add documents in your Wix website. You're simply going to go to add and traditionally it'll open automatically into text. But we're going to go down to more. When we get down to more, we'll see document buttons right here we will see multiple different buttons for multiple different document types. Now, it truly doesn't matter which one of the, I mean, obviously you're going to want to click the corresponding one to your document, but I'll show you why in a second. So we'll click that, and then it'll open our media library, and this is where we'll just automatically add whatever document it is we're going to add. Now, there is certain formats you have to follow, as listed right there, PDF, Doc, Doc, DocX, you see them right here. Um, and then we would simply click upload docs. I'll just upload uh, this, a Word document. I just created this for fun. I'll click done. Once I do that, you'll click add to page. And then bam, just like that right here, if we press save, okay, we press preview. We've got a document and it'll download just like that, as easy as that. Now guys, let me just show you something. Right here, the settings on the file go like this. So, you could change the file, you could change the icon, and you could even change and show the title on the uh, document. But other than that, it's that simple to add a document to your Wix website. And then you could go and add a button, and you could have that button linked to the document. And I'll show you how you do that. You have a button, then you just double click that button. Once you do that, it'll say right here, where does it link to? You go to add a link, and then right here, document. And then you would simply choose the file. So in this case, I already have it uploaded. It would be that. Bam. Done. All right. You go to click the button. There you go. Downloads the document for you. Very useful. Very easy to do. And if this video helped you guys out, I encourage you liking the video thank you guys if you do i appreciate that comment if you have any questions at all and don't forget to subscribe to me here on computer md of gilbert as i am looking forward to growing with you guys and part of that growth is this wix my website course again wixmywebsite.com link in the description below if you guys are watching these tutorial videos you're already taking the first step just take that next step and plunge into this course with me uh, if you have not yet signed up for the email list, go ahead and do so. I encourage you to. The first people, the first 10 people uh, will that enroll in the course will get, receive a very special, very valuable gift. And the first people to know about the course will be the people on the email list. So if you have not yet done that, go ahead and do that. Other than that, thank you guys for spending a couple minutes with me tonight.